Hi, my name is Carrie Stanzian Albertic. I am the program coordinator for one of two new programs here at Stark State College. I am the program coordinator for surgical assisting, and we also have a new surgical technology program. I would like to explain the differences between the two programs to you. Many people don't know the difference between a surgical technician and a surgical assistant. Surgical technicians work in the operating room, but they set up the instruments on the instrument table and all of the equipment that the surgeon will need to use during the operative procedure. So they are the ones that will set up the Mayo stand and pass the instruments to the surgeon and the surgical assistant or the resident, whoever is assisting the surgeon. Surgical technologists will also learn the basics of sterile technique, which is very important in surgery. You have to learn what the barriers are so you do not contaminate, and that prevents surgical infections from taking place. The surgical assistant actually is the one that works right across from the surgeon, hand in hand, and assists them by providing optimal exposure for the procedure, suctioning, suturing, and at the end of the procedure, the surgeon will generally ask the assistant to close the wound for them, and they will leave the room. Surgical assistants also will help prior to the start of the surgery by prepping the patient, shaving the patient, looking at the chart, making sure that the surgeon has everything that they need for the procedure. Surgical assistants will also learn how to position a patient, how to apply dressings, how to apply casts when applicable, draping techniques, suturing techniques, as well as how to tie suture. Students that are interested in the surgical assisting program cannot apply for that program unless they are already a current certified surgical technologist, have a military background in the operating room, or are currently an RN with a CNOR credential. Thank you.